pour this into the toilet and say goodbye to debts, poverty and bad luck forever. Buddhist wisdom. Pour this into your toilet and you'll say goodbye to debts, poverty and bad luck forever. Your home is the center of your life and everything begins and ends there. The toilet, a place often overlooked, can trap negative energy, silently affecting every aspect of your life. But just as easily, it can be transformed into a source of positive energy, bringing prosperity and fortune your way. In today's video on the Mindful Wisdom, I'm sharing a powerful yet simple Buddhist ritual that can cleanse your home of all negative influences by simply using your toilet. This ritual not only purifies your living space, but also opens the door to financial abundance and success, making your dreams a reality. Stay with me until the end, and you'll be surprised by how something so simple can have such a profound impact on your life. Vance 1. The Ritual and Its Significance in the teachings of Buddhism, it is often emphasized that our external environment is a mirror of our inner world. This belief resonates deeply with the idea that by cleansing our physical surroundings, we can also cleanse our spiritual and emotional states. The ritual of pouring a substance into the toilet to rid oneself of debts, poverty and bad luck is more than just a symbolic act. It is a powerful practice rooted in the understanding that the energy we cultivate within ourselves directly impacts the reality we experience. This concept is supported not only by spiritual teachings, but also by modern scientific findings. Quantum physics has revealed that our intentions and energy can indeed influence the world around us. This isn't merely a mystical idea, it's backed by evidence that our thoughts and emotions can shape our environment. For instance, Dr. Masaru Emoto's groundbreaking water experiments showed that positive words and intentions could alter the molecular structure of water, forming beautiful symmetrical crystals. This suggests that the energy we project can have a tangible effect on the physical world, including our immediate surroundings. Just as a Buddhist monk might sweep the temple grounds to remove negative energies and purify the space, so too can we cleanse our homes to remove the worries and misfortunes that burden us. The act of pouring this substance into the toilet becomes a ritualistic release of negativity, a way to symbolically flush away the debts, poverty and bad luck that may have accumulated in our lives. In modern life, where stress and financial worries often dominate our thoughts, it is crucial to find practices that help us realign our energies and intentions. By adopting this simple yet profound ritual, we align ourselves with the natural flow of positive energy, allowing abundance and good fortune to enter our lives. As the Buddha wisely said, What we think, we become reminding us that our thoughts and actions are powerful forces in shaping our destiny. Therefore, this ritual serves as a reminder that we have the power to cleanse our lives from negativity and to attract prosperity and happiness through mindful actions and positive intentions. This practice not only helps in clearing physical spaces, but also aids in purifying the mind, leading to a more peaceful and prosperous life. By understanding the significance of this ritual, we can embrace the idea that every action, no matter how small, can have a profound impact on our lives, bringing us closer to a state of balance, peace and abundance. 2. Personal Story and Experience Now, let me share with you a practice that might sound unusual at first, yet it has profoundly changed my life placing a garlic clove in your toilet. It may seem strange, but this simple ritual brought an unexpected turnaround in my financial situation. My story begins during one of the most challenging periods of my life. I had just lost my job, a position that had allowed me to provide comfortably for my family. But overnight, everything changed. 
Unemployment struck, and with it came an overwhelming wave of fear and uncertainty. My savings dwindled rapidly, and the pressure of mounting bills became unbearable. Weeks passed, and then months, trapping me in a spiral of negativity. Each day, my self-confidence eroded further, and I felt as if I was sinking into a deep abyss of despair. The relentless stress of unpaid rent, daily expenses, and my children's medical needs took a toll on my health. I was losing weight, sleep, and most painfully, hope. Debt had become an all-consuming force in my life, draining my energy and leaving me feeling powerless. I tried every possible solution, prayer, vision boards, positive thinking and affirmations. Yet despite my efforts, nothing seemed to work. After a month, I was still jobless, buried in debt and emotionally exhausted. It felt like I was walking through a never-ending tunnel with no light in sight. Just when I thought all hope was lost, a friend reached out to me with an unusual suggestion. He introduced me to a ritual that involved a garlic clove, claiming it could help wipe out my debts overnight. I was skeptical, but the conviction in his voice made me curious enough to try it. He explained the ritual step by step, emphasizing the importance of cleanliness. A clean bathroom, he said, is essential for the flow of positive energy. He advised keeping the bathroom free of clutter, ensuring the trash was regularly emptied, and most importantly, keeping the toilet lid closed when not in use. According to him, an open toilet not only releases physical waste, but also allows negative energy to circulate, particularly at night, when our energy is at its lowest. Following his advice, I meticulously cleaned my bathroom, ensuring everything was in order. Then, with a mixture of skepticism and hope, I followed his instructions. I wrote down the total amount of my debt on a piece of paper. $13,460. A number that filled me with dread. With the garlic clove in my hand, I took a deep breath, closed my eyes, and began to chant. All debts are now fully paid, one by one. As I repeated this mantra, I visualized my debts disappearing, imagining them vanishing from my bank account and mailbox. Finally, I threw the garlic clove into the toilet, flushing away my financial burden symbolically. That night, I slept more peacefully than I had in months, feeling a renewed sense of hope. I had no idea what would happen next, but I trusted the process completely. The following morning, I awoke with a sense of calm. As the days passed, I noticed subtle changes. Opportunities began to present themselves, and my financial situation started to improve. This experience taught me the power of intention and the impact our environment can have on our lives. By focusing on positive energy and cleanliness, we can invite transformation into our lives. As Buddha reminded us, The mind is everything. What you think, you become. This simple yet profound ritual was a reminder that with faith, positive energy and the right mindset, anything is possible. Step-by-step -step guide to the ritual. To embark on this powerful ritual, aimed at breaking the chains of debt, poverty, and bad luck, you must first gather the necessary items, a fresh garlic clove, ground cinnamon, a green candle, a medium-sized mirror, two sheets of white paper, and a pen or marker. The significance of these items is rooted in ancient wisdom, each playing a vital role in attracting prosperity and warding off negativity. Begin by finding a serene space in your home, ideally close to where you manage your finances or work. This space will serve as your sanctuary, a sacred ground where you can harness the energy of abundance and set the stage for a brighter financial future. As you light the green candle, feel the warmth and hope it emits. The green candle, symbolizing money and fortune, is more than just a flame. It is a beacon of hope, illuminating not only the room, but also the pathway to your financial liberation. Visualize this flame growing brighter, 
its light spreading to every corner of your life, filling it with the prosperity you seek. Take one sheet of white paper and write down the name of your main source of debt. By doing so, you confront this debt head-on, acknowledging it as an obstacle to your financial freedom. This act of naming your debt is symbolic. It is the first crucial step in loosening its grip on your life. Remember the words of the Buddha, The mind is everything. What you think, you become. By acknowledging your debt, you take control of your financial destiny, laying the groundwork for future abundance. Next, position the mirror in such a way that it reflects the candle's flame. The mirror in this ritual is not just a simple reflective surface, it is a powerful portal, amplifying the energy of prosperity and helping you connect with your inner reservoir of abundance. Hold the garlic clove in your dominant hand, this simple yet potent item has been used for centuries to ward off evil and attract positive energies. Write the exact amount of your debt on the garlic clove and then sprinkle it with ground cinnamon. The cinnamon, with its sweet and spicy fragrance, symbolizes the attraction of wealth and prosperity. Close your eyes, take a deep breath and vividly imagine your debt melting away like snow in the warmth of the sun. As you do this, declare out loud with unwavering conviction. With this ritual, I am free of debt. Prosperity flows into my life. I am blessed with financial abundance here and now. These words, spoken with belief and intention, hold the power to transform your financial reality. Now, place the garlic clove on a symbolic bill of money that you have created by writing the total amount of your debt on a sheet of paper combine this with the name of the debt source. This paper, now representing the financial burden you wish to eliminate, is ready to be released. Light the tip of the paper, allowing the flame to consume it. As the fire burns away the physical representation of your debt, repeat the affirmation. My debts are being transformed. Prosperity is on its way. Watch as the flames turn the paper to ash, symbolizing the dissolution of your financial burdens. Ensure you burn the paper safely, away from any flammable materials. With the flames extinguished, turn your attention to the mirror once again. Absorb the light from the green candle as it reflects back at you. See it not just as a physical light, but as a metaphorical beacon of hope and prosperity. Let this light seep into your very being, illuminating your financial life and guiding you toward the abundance that awaits you. Finally, it's time to release the negative energy tied to your financial burdens. Take the garlic clove, now charged with your intentions, and throw it into the toilet. Flush it away, symbolizing the release of debt and negative financial energy from your life. As you watch it disappear, Imagine all your financial burdens being washed away, leaving behind only a clean slate, ready to be filled with prosperity. As the ritual comes to a close, take a moment to visualize the prosperous life you desire. A life where you are debt-free, surrounded by endless opportunities, and enjoying the abundance that the universe is ready to offer. Let feelings of joy and gratitude fill your heart as you thank the universe for the blessings you have and the ones yet to come. Embrace the certainty that the universe, in all its wisdom, is conspiring in your favor, guiding you ever closer to your financial dreams. In this ritual, you are not only working to rid yourself of debt, but also aligning yourself with the flow of the universe's abundance. After learning about this powerful ritual to break the chains of debt, poverty, and bad luck, do you believe in the impact of such spiritual practices on financial well-being? Comment yes if you do, or share your thoughts with comment number one if you have a different perspective. Maintain a positive mindset. To free yourself from the clutches of debt, and ensure that poverty remains a distant memory. It is imperative to cultivate and maintain a positive mindset. 
This mindset is not merely a passing thought or a temporary state of optimism, but rather the very foundation upon which your financial freedom is constructed. Think of your mind as a fertile garden, where every thought you harbour acts as a seed. If you sow seeds of doubt, fear and negativity, your garden will inevitably be overrun by the weeds of despair, choking out any chance for prosperity. Conversely, when you nourish your mind with positive thoughts and water it consistently with beliefs in success and abundance, you create a thriving environment where wealth and opportunity can take root and flourish. One of the most powerful tools in this process is the practice of positive affirmations. These are not just words. They are powerful declarations that shape your reality by reinforcing your belief in your ability to achieve financial stability and wealth. Whenever you catch yourself worrying about bills or doubting your capacity to make ends meet, counter those negative thoughts with affirmations that reaffirm your belief in abundance. Tell yourself, I am capable of overcoming any financial challenge. Wealth flows to me effortlessly. I deserve to live a life free from debt. These affirmations are more than just comforting phrases. They are a means of reprogramming your subconscious mind, aligning it with the limitless possibilities that lie ahead. To illustrate the power of a positive mindset, consider this story from Buddhist teachings. Once, a poor man, overwhelmed by misfortune and poverty, sought the counsel of a wise monk. The man lamented, I am cursed with bad luck and will never escape my poverty. The monk, after listening patiently, handed the man a small, empty jar and said, This jar will bring you great wealth, but only if you believe it can. The man, though sceptical, was desperate and took the jar home. Each day he would place a small coin in the jar, repeating to himself, This jar brings me wealth. As the days turned into weeks, the man's mindset began to shift. He no longer viewed himself as a poor man. Instead, he saw himself as someone on the path to wealth. The jar became a symbol of his growing belief in his ability to attract abundance. Over time, as his mindset shifted, the man began to notice opportunities that had always been there but had gone unnoticed. His income increased, and eventually he was able to lift himself out of poverty. The jar itself held no magical powers. But the man's belief in its power, and in his own ability to change his circumstances, was transformative. By maintaining a positive mindset, you align yourself with the energy of wealth and success, making it easier for opportunities to come your way. Your thoughts are incredibly powerful, and they shape your reality in ways you may not fully comprehend. The lesson here is simple yet profound. By cultivating a positive mindset, you are not only erasing your debts, but also creating a life where poverty has no place. The value of this mindset extends far beyond financial freedom. It grants you the profound peace of knowing that you hold the power to shape your destiny, regardless of where you begin. As the Buddha once said, What you think, you become. What you feel, you attract. What you imagine, you create. By embracing this wisdom and nurturing a positive mindset, you unlock the door to a future filled with abundance, success, and unshakable inner peace. Reinforce gratitude daily. Reinforcing gratitude daily is not just a simple habit, it's a powerful transformation that can reshape your entire life, especially your financial situation. In a world constantly pushing us toward materialism and more consumption, it's easy to overlook the treasures we already possess. However, when you make a deliberate choice to be thankful each day, whether for the roof over your head, the food that nourishes you, or the love and support of those around you, you start to shift your mindset from one of scarcity to one of abundance. This shift is far more profound than mere positive thinking, it's about creating a fertile environment where prosperity can flourish. 
the Buddha once said, Contentment is the greatest wealth, reminding us that true richness comes not from accumulating more, but from appreciating what we already have. This doesn't mean you should settle for less or give up on your dreams. Rather, it means recognizing the wealth in your current circumstances while staying open to future blessings. Imagine starting each day with a heart brimming with gratitude, acknowledging the abundance in your life. This practice sends out waves of positive energy that attract even more opportunities and prosperity. Consider your life as a garden. Gratitude is the rich, nourishing soil in which the seeds of success and financial well-being are planted. Without this fertile ground, those seeds struggle to take root and grow. Moreover, gratitude is a powerful antidote to the anxiety and fear that often accompany financial difficulties. By focusing on what you already have, rather than what you lack, you open your mind to new possibilities and solutions that you may have previously overlooked. This conscious practice of gratitude isn't passive, it's an active, ongoing effort that can profoundly impact your mental and emotional well-being ultimately leading to wiser financial decisions. In our fast-paced world, where consumerism and instant gratification are the norms, cultivating gratitude can serve as a much-needed counterbalance. It reminds us that true wealth isn't about the amount in our bank accounts, but the depth of our appreciation for the simple yet profound blessings life offers. By making gratitude a daily practice, you lay the foundation for both financial stability and inner peace. As the saying goes, Gratitude turns what we have into enough. This perspective doesn't discourage striving for more, but it ensures that your pursuit is driven by a sense of abundance rather than a fear of lack. Let me share a story from Buddhist teachings that beautifully illustrates the power of gratitude, there once was a monk who had nothing but a small bowl and a robe. He lived simply with no possessions or wealth, yet he was known throughout the land for his deep peace and joy. One day, a king, curious about the source of the monk's happiness, invited him to the palace and asked, How can you be so content when you have nothing? The monk smiled and replied, I have everything I need, my heart is full of gratitude for each breath I take, the food that nourishes me, and the beauty of the world around me. That is my true wealth, which no one can take from me. The king, moved by these words, realized that despite his immense riches, he had never known the monk's profound peace. This story reminds us that when we cultivate gratitude, we tap into a deep well of inner richness that no external wealth can match. Now, I ask you, what would your life look like if you started each day by acknowledging and appreciating the blessings you already have? How might this shift in focus change the way you approach your financial challenges and your overall outlook on life? By embracing gratitude, you not only invite more abundance into your life, but also find strength and clarity in the face of adversity. So, begin today, count your blessings, no matter how small, and witness the transformation as your life overflows with prosperity, peace, and true wealth. Live simply and contentedly. In our fast-paced modern world, where the constant pursuit of material wealth and the latest luxuries often define success, Many of us find ourselves caught in an unending cycle of chasing after possessions, accumulating debt, and feeling perpetually dissatisfied. We are bombarded with messages that tell us happiness lies in acquiring the newest gadgets, luxury items, or the next big thrill. However, this pursuit often leaves us empty, burdened by financial strain, and disconnected from what truly matters. But what if the key to lasting happiness and freedom from financial stress lies not in acquiring more, but in wanting less? Buddhist teachings offer a timeless and transformative approach to this dilemma, 
one rooted in the principles of simplicity and contentment. As the Buddha wisely taught, contentment is the greatest wealth. A reminder that our true riches are not found in the material world, but within our hearts and minds. This profound statement invites us to shift our focus from external acquisitions to internal fulfillment, guiding us to seek happiness not in what we possess, but in who we are. To embody this wisdom in our daily lives, we must consciously redirect our energy from the relentless pursuit of more to a deep appreciation for what we already have. This doesn't mean we must abandon all comforts or live in deprivation. Rather, it calls for mindful choices about what truly adds value to our lives and the courage to let go of what does not. Imagine the relief of cutting back on unnecessary expenses, the clarity that comes from being mindful of your purchases, and the joy of prioritizing experiences and relationships over material things. Consider the wisdom in the saying, the richest man is not he who has the most, but he who needs the least. By reducing our desires, we not only ease our financial burdens, but also create the space to pursue our true passions, nurture our relationships, and deepen our spiritual growth. In this light, simplicity is not about sacrifice, but about making room for what truly matters in life. Living simply and contentedly also means embracing the present moment, finding joy in the here and now, rather than postponing happiness for some future date tied to material success. Too often, we push ourselves to work harder, earn more, and buy more, in the hope that these efforts will secure our happiness. Yet this approach often leads to burnout and a sense of missing out on life's simple pleasures. Buddhism teaches us the importance of mindfulness, of being fully present in each moment, aware of our thoughts and actions, and finding peace in the simplicity of now. This shift in perspective allows us to become less driven by the endless desire for more and more satisfied with what we already have. Moreover, simplifying our lives can significantly reduce the stress and anxiety that often accompany financial pressures. Debt and poverty are not merely financial problems, they are deeply intertwined with our mental and emotional well-being. When we live beyond our means, the weight of financial obligations can feel overwhelming, clouding our minds and spirits. However, by choosing a life of simplicity, we lighten this burden, enabling ourselves to breathe more easily and think more clearly. This mental clarity is invaluable, empowering us to make wiser decisions, both financially and personally, leading to a more balanced and fulfilling life. As we adopt a simpler lifestyle, our perception of the world begins to change. We start to see beauty in the small, often overlooked details of life, a vibrant sunset, a quiet moment of reflection, or the warmth of a loved one's smile. These moments, which cannot be bought, bring us immense joy and a sense of deep fulfillment. This shift in perspective is not just refreshing, it is transformative, revealing that true happiness and contentment are found in places we might have previously ignored. Living simply and contentedly is more than just a financial strategy. It is a profound spiritual practice that has the power to transform our entire existence. By focusing on what genuinely matters, we can free ourselves from the chains of materialism and debt, discover a deeper sense of inner satisfaction, and live a life of true abundance. Have you ever considered that the secret to overcoming financial burdens and achieving lasting happiness might lie in embracing simplicity and contentment what steps can you take today to align your life more closely with these timeless teachings and unlock the door to true peace and prosperity? 7. Learn Money Management Mastering money management is an essential step in breaking free from the shackles of debt, poverty 
and financial stress. Imagine a life where you are no longer burdened by the anxiety of debt, where your finances are a source of empowerment rather than worry, and where you confidently stride toward a future where money serves you, not the other way around. This vision isn't just a dream. It's within your grasp, but it requires a deliberate and disciplined approach to managing your finances. The first step in this journey is to embrace the importance of financial education. As the old saying goes, knowledge is power. And nowhere is this truer than in the realm of personal finance. When you invest your time in learning about money management, whether through books, courses, or financial counseling, you are arming yourself with the tools needed to navigate the complex world of finance with wisdom and foresight. Without a solid grasp of financial principles, you are vulnerable to the many pitfalls that can lead to financial ruin. Consider this. Many individuals find themselves trapped in a cycle of living beyond their means, relying on credit to sustain a lifestyle they cannot afford, and eventually sinking deeper into debt. This is not just a matter of poor decision-making. It's a lack of understanding of how money works. The Buddha's Wisdom The mind is everything. What you think you become applies directly to your financial life. By thinking and acting like a wise steward of your resources, you cultivate the habits that lead to financial stability and growth. On the contrary, neglecting financial education leaves you on a precarious path where poor money management becomes a self-fulfilling prophecy. The process of gaining financial knowledge is not just about learning how to handle money better. It's about building the confidence and capability to make decisions that align with your life's goals. You begin to see the importance of saving, the power of compound interest, and the value of avoiding unnecessary debt. Instead of reacting to financial problems, you start to anticipate and prevent them, positioning yourself as the architect of your financial well-being. But knowledge alone is not enough. The true power of financial education lies in its application. It's one thing to read about budgeting, but it's another to sit down and create a budget that works for you. It's easy to understand the need to save, but the real challenge lies in consistently setting aside a portion of your income, no matter how small, and watching it grow over time. These actions, while seemingly small, accumulate to make a significant impact on your financial health. Just as the Buddha said, a jug fills drop by drop. Every wise financial decision you make adds to your reservoir of security and peace of mind. In modern life, where consumerism is rampant and the pressure to keep up with others can be overwhelming, learning to manage your money wisely is not just a skill, it's a necessity. By taking control of your finances, you empower yourself to live a life free from the anxiety of debt and financial uncertainty. You gain the freedom to make choices that enrich your life and support your long-term goals, rather than being driven by the immediate demands of creditors and bills. The journey to financial freedom is indeed a marathon, not a sprint. It requires patience, persistence, and a commitment to making smart choices daily. But the rewards, financial security, peace of mind, and the ability to pursue your passions without the burden of debt are well worth the effort. So, take the first step today. Invest in your financial education, apply what you learn, and watch as your financial life transforms, drop by drop, into a jug filled with abundance and opportunity. As we conclude today's journey together, I trust that the wisdom shared has resonated with you offering not just knowledge but a practical path to transform your life. The simple yet profound Buddhist practices we explored have the power to cleanse your space and invite prosperity, turning the tide against debts and bad luck. Remember, true change begins with mindful actions, and by embracing these rituals, you're aligning yourself with a life of abundance and peace. 
If this video has brought value to you, I encourage you to like it, share it with those who might also benefit, and join our growing community by subscribing to the Baiti Mindful Wisdom. Don't forget to turn on the notification bell so you're the first to know when we release new content. Together, let's continue to explore the timeless wisdom that can transform our lives for the better. Thank you for being here, and I look forward to sharing more with you in our next video.